Ahoy! Let's think. Today we answer the question, why does poison ivy make you itch? When working with plants or going for a hike in the woods, you should remember these sayings. Leaves of three, let them be. Longer middle stem, don't touch them. And hairy vine, no friend of mine. All these sayings are to help remind us to be wary of a specific plant, poison ivy. If you've ever been in contact with poison ivy, you probably know that it can cause itchiness and blisters on your skin. But why does it do this? Poison ivy along with poison oak and poison sumac all contain oil called urushiol, which can be found in the sap. Coming from the Japanese word urushi, meaning lacquer, it's named after the urushi trees, which also produce sap. The oil is an allergen, which can cause an allergic reaction to your skin. Surprisingly, the oil doesn't cause an allergic reaction on everyone. About 60 to 80% of people can be affected when they come into contact with these poisonous plants. After coming into contact with these plants, you may not see its effect right away. You may not experience itchiness or a rash until 12 to 72 hours later. Why does this oil affect our skin in this way? To put it simply, when urushiol comes into contact with our skin, our body recognizes it as a foreign substance and triggers an immune response. Our cells work to destroy the toxic material. But, like in all battles, there are some casualties. Our normal tissue can also become damaged, which is what causes the redness and rash that we normally see. But don't fret. Poison ivy isn't like a cold. It's not contagious and you can't spread it. Unfortunately, it can take up to one to two weeks for your skin to heal. That doesn't sound like too much fun. So the next time you're working with plants, remember those three sayings. So that answers, why does poison ivy make you itch? That took some thinking.